my homies home guy here so I'm um, coming at you guys today with a couple of mass troop gameplays that me and my friend Nightcloud did so all of my videos are probably gonna be like so out of order I mean I had some problems with the internet on my laptop so I had recorded like five or so different games well videos and I just cannot upload all of those that quickly. I probably should just stop making, like, recording YouTube videos for a little bit. But I'm just that nice of a guy. So anyways, last uh, this is like the night before the update, the 4th of July update. Happy whatever to you guys. Happy 4th of July. If you don't live in the U.S., then you probably don't care. Even though we're like the second best country. Because Canada is like the best. Canada rocks. But anyways, let's get into those replays. Hey everyone, I'm back. So, just forgive me because my internet is kind of like really sucking right now. Like it always does. That's also the reason why I have not done, like, DPO or anything, because I'm sitting there, and I'm getting, like, one frame per second, and it sucks. I have gotten the Necromancer, though, so clap for me. But yeah, what we first do is we take out each other's towers so that we have more space to put down, like, tombstones and elixir collectors, and we don't have to worry about taking out a tower. Except for the King's Tower. But yeah, if you guys remember, I got a Sparky. Uh, he is less OP than I thought he was when I'm playing him. Maybe it's just because I suck. Just a fact of life. I suck. Like a lot. But anyways, then we're just stacking up those Elixir Collectors. And it's just getting crazy. I mean, you know, and then we, we start nearing, like, double elixir time, which is not when we start, because when you're doing, like, a friendly battle, it gets really nice and easy, because you have three minutes of overtime, so you can just keep stacking up those elixir collectors. But yeah, if you guys remember one of my last videos, I got a Sparky, I was happy about that. But, yeah, in this new update, there's so much stuff coming out. I, I swear to you, all of you guys, I've been calling the Ice Spirits for a while now. Maybe not like a couple of months, but fairly long. I mean, I've just been calling them like a boss. So, yeah. Oh, wait, this is the Ice Wizard one. I remember this. Okay. This one isn't quite as good. But, you know, YOLO. Maybe I won't even add this. But, yeah, I guess we're pulling up the Sparky one next time. Yeah. That's cool. So we're just pulling up those Ice Wizards. There's just so many ice wizards. And ice wizards do like no damage. It's pretty bad. But yeah, I'm gonna pull up the next replay. Tap, tap, tap the watch, tap the watch all day. My internet really sucks and that sucks because my internet really sucks. Okay, what, what, what? 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 Okay, okay, I think... What? What the, what, what the heck? What? what? What just happened? Did anybody else see that? What? What? I hope they fix that in the update. I mean, what the heck? Ugh, anyways, so, now we're actually gonna do the Sparky battle. 
So, I got a Sparky. I've said that before a lot. Sparky's cool. I like Sparky. He's good at taking out towers. But anyways, so I did, we just place elixir collectors. I'm going to speed this up. Let's speed this up to four. Just, it's not as cool when we're just sitting around building up elixir collectors. It's not that cool. When you get into overtime and I start just like barreling down the sparkies, it just gets so much better. And a lot more interesting. But yeah. Those tombstones, man, they wreck. Um, yeah, my minions are just taking out all of his skeletons. There's so many skeletons. Okay, so now we're in sudden death. I'll just speed it up until start the sparky. The sparky overload. Okay, I think this is where I start. Maybe not. I just suck at knowing where I start. I hope that wasn't some kind of obscure reference. Okay, let's start the Sparky. No, still just waiting. I will remember you after I have like a bunch of Sparkies attack you. I promise you guys, I do not have like a hit single DVD. What? Why is there a little one just? What? I'm only one call away. I'll be there to save the day. Superman got not okay one. Yeah, but um, what the heck? There's just a has this been here the entire time? I don't think so. But yeah, we already have five sparkies. You guys probably know how much one Sparky does. Unless you just don't play the game and you're just watching me because you love my singing abilities. Or you know me and I'm forcing you to watch this. That's a good reason too. But yeah, that that's a lot of Sparkies. And he's just like mirroring the freeze. Because, I mean... When you have this many Sparkies, you're kind of just screwed. I mean... It's just a fact of life. A bunch of sparkies equals screwed. It, it's just how life works. They, they should make a meme on that to tell you that that's how life works. Yep. Then we have like freaking nine sparkies. Yay. Feel the power of the nine sparkies. Literally, in less than two seconds, taking out his king tower. Feel the power of the sparky. But y'all, pull up the next one. Now let's start this up again. And this time we are doing witches. Have fun with the skeletons. So I remember, like, Nick at night, he was doing, like, something on the developer build. Like a mass troop gameplay for Clash of Clans. Oh, those are the best. But, yeah. I remember, like, somebody had asked him to do, like, a mass witch gameplay, and he's like, Yeah, I've tried that before, but it kind of, like, lags out hard on the game. In my reference, just from the way that he said that, kind of like when you get to, like, over 110 levels in BTD battle battles, or more just BTD5, that is, like, my game. Been playing it since I was, like, in second grade. Great game. But yeah, I... I have... My level has been so high in there, like, probably close to 100. I forget how the levels work or whatever. I had every troop max level. It was just insane. I had everything. But yeah, that, we're just... Witching it up. And look at all those elixir pumps. Look at the elixir pumps. There's just so many. Oh, and now we have the witches, and they're going with all of their mighty skeletons. Yay. Just look at all those skeletons. That's like their own personal skeleton army. 
Then he has to go and arrow it or zap it or whatever. Thanks, man. We get like... One, two, three, four, five... We get a bunch of witches. And that's how it works in life. You get a bunch of witches. Let's just open this free chest. So... I'm gonna post this video after the update, so it's gonna look really weird that there is no Arena 8, and that you can just do a training match right here. That'll be nice. You know, how about this? I'm gonna do a training match for you guys. Let's just queue up a deck. Okay guys, so I have queued up a deck for you, okay? Let's try this out. I might have to talk to you guys about the Mika deck. The most overpowered deck for like arenas 3 and up, probably even before that. More like arenas 2 and up. It is insane. It's great. It uses the expo though. So let's just start out with goblins. Let's arrow this. Yep. Feel the arrows. Let's build up a couple of elixir collectors. He's not making much sense. Okay, that makes more sense. I'm just gonna completely ignore that and I might lose to the trainer. But who cares? Does anybody really care? Okay. Let's just do this. Okay. That's nice. <sighs> okay. Let's try to surround this bomber. And that failed. And he still got a bomb off. Let's do this. Okay. Okay, let's put down a couple more elixir collectors. With all these minions shielding for the witch. Okay. Just trying to put down those elixir collectors like a boss. Ba 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 da ba Okay, just counter this bomber, and let's put down a Sparky, because that makes total sense. Let's put down this minion horde, Min minions and minion horde. It's just gonna, that might take out, no, it's not gonna take out the Sparky before the rest of that happens. Okay. Oh no, Sparky's gonna take out the tower. Oops. Well, that's good. Okay, I'll come back to you guys later. Hey guys, I am back. And I am home guy. I am not Eclipse. My name is not Eclipse. And I'm gonna get a trademark. Oh crap. But anyways, um... Uh, oh, that didn't just like overload my speaker. But anyways, guys... If you guys don't know me, I'm Home Guy. I do mobile games and Clash Royale videos, even though Clash Royale is a mobile game. That just sounds stupid. But yeah, I do games and whatever the crap you guys want me to. Put down in the comments if you have some game that you want me to play. I'm good with that. Put down any recommendations you have. I'm free. I'm not set down by crazy copyright deals and stuff like that. You guys probably just noticed that I switched my overlay. That or you just cannot see. Sorry, I'm very insensitive. Anyways, this is just a picture of Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege. It's not Siege, it's just Rainbow Six. But yeah guys, sorry I could not upload any videos recently, but I was on vacation. So cut me some slack, you know, summer vacations. It's really hard to upload and edit stuff when you don't have a laptop and all you have is your phone. I've just been playing Pokemon Go and that kind of stuff. But anyways, guys, just remember to clash on and peace out.